Good morning, everyone. Today I am hosting a hibachi at my house. Well, it's actually my boyfriend's house, Chino's house. So Let's Hibachi reached out and wanted me to do a video. So I'm like, you know what? This is the perfect farewell to me getting my surgery, to celebrating a lot of things I've uh, that I've been able to accomplish in the past few weeks and even few months it's really hard for me to hang out with my friends because of how busy i have been but i mean they get it they understand that i've been like hustling so it's really cool right now i just stopped at dollar tree i picked up some last minute things because i forgot to get like uh plastic plates for the snacks but other than that we have like everything ready not set up but ready to set up i'm gonna head over to Publix right now i'm gonna try to look for some sake because since it's hibachi we're like we should have sake so hopefully they have it i do live um in like an area where there's not a lot of asian influence so finding sake might be a little bit hard um but you know fingers crossed and we find it so instead of supporting Publix, we are at our local asian market it's really crazy because when you look up asian market on like apple this does not pop up so the oriental market is just under like normal grocery store and the closest Asian market supposedly on Google and Apple is like 30 minutes away when this is 15. Walked in, asked if they had sake and I got a big fat no. So instead I got some oolong tea because I did run out. I'm a big fan of oolong. This is pretty much what I drink very frequently in the morning. I feel like it helps me just, I don't know what it helps for. Supposedly it like keeps you, you know, well, but I just really like the flavor. Um, the owner though told me to go to Total Wine because they have a big sake selection instead of Publix. So that is where we're going. We're at Total Wine and I just realized that I have literally like five, no more than 10 minutes to go in, get the sake, come out and go to McDonald's because I'm supposed to be picking up McDonald's breakfast for Chino, his mom and me. And McDonald's breakfast ends at 10.30 and it is 10.05 so we, we gotta go quick. The variety is not too bad. Oh, there's more over here. All right, let me, let me look at these really well and see what we're gonna get for the house. All right, so this is what I ended up leaving with. I got two bottles for uh, 40 bucks. Um, the guy recommended like a cheaper one and I'm like, is this one popular because it's cheap or because it's good? And he's like, I think because it's cheap. So I'm like, no, I'm not gonna get that. So hopefully these are good. I have, like 10 minutes to get to McDonald's. So hopefully I get this breakfast for us. Secured the goods. Um, I didn't really like have McDonald's breakfast again in my life after being a kid. I would always get like, you know, those little meals that you would have as a kid. Um, but recently I tried a McGriddle and it like changed my life, but I get it only with egg and cheese. The sausage and like bacon and stuff like makes me very sick whenever I eat it so I don't get it like that but the other thing that I do is I get a round egg I heard or I saw a video on TikTok that the round egg they crack fresh every day while the folded one is like the liquid thing so I'm like round egg it is always so yeah last time I had a hash brown I also got very sick um and when I mean sick I mean like really bad stomach ache acid reflux and all that stuff so I got another one today to see if it makes me sick again now I'm gonna be heading into Starbucks to get us some drinks I don't really think I'm gonna get anything I usually get a passion tea lemonade and it has been so bad the last two times I've had it everything is now set up for my friends to come we got these cute little um, what are they called like toppers table covers at Walmart they look really nice so pretty much we have it set up just like hibachi. Unfortunately, this table is shorter, but it's enough for all of us because it's nine of us. Hibachi will be there. And this is the cleanest the house has ever been. We got some snacks and drinks. My friends are honestly not gonna get here until like the hibachi starts. Knowing them, I told them four o'clock, which means like 5, 30, 6 o'clock in their world. So. We're gonna be chilling. I have so many videos to edit, but I can't wait to show you guys what the hibachi vibe is like. Ooh. 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 Ooh.
So hibachi yesterday was so much fun. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that maybe this like encourages you to do a hibachi at your place. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button to be up to date with more daily vlogs.